It's okay. All you need is to get some sun. Vitamin D is a nutrient your body needs for building and maintaining healthy bones. That's because your body only can absorb calcium, which is the primary component of bone, when vitamin D is present. It's the key in absorbing calcium to maintain bone health and strengthen your bones. It supports a healthy brain, heart, teeth, and lungs. Vitamin D lets your immune system stay strong and can help regulate insulin levels. It keeps your energy levels up and makes you not feel like you are the only person in the world by enhancing your mood. Let's check the symptoms of vitamin D deficiency. Muscle pain, bone pain, increased sensitivity to pain, pins and needles sensation in the hands or feet, muscle weakness in body parts near the trunk of the body, such as the upper arms or thighs. There are some ways that can increase your vitamin D. Eat foods high in vitamin D like fish or fortified breakfast food, milk, cereals and orange juice. Get vitamin D from moderate sunlight exposure each day or take a vitamin D3 supplement or cod liver oil. What helps vitamin D absorption? Keep in mind that vitamin D is a fat-soluble vitamin, which means it's best absorbed in the bloodstream in the presence of dietary fat. So, if you're taking your vitamin D supplement at breakfast, lunch, or dinner, let it be the companion of a food containing healthy fat. The best times for taking vitamin D are alongside breakfast or with a bedtime snack as long as it doesn't interfere with your sleep. The key is to find what works for you and stick with it to ensure you're meeting your vitamin D needs. Taking vitamin D with a meal can increase its absorption, but studies on specific timings are limited. Hope researchers will do better. What if we try so hard to absorb vitamin D but some factors reduce or block it? Well, these factors are conditions such as celiac disease, chronic pancreatitis, Crohn's disease, and cystic fibrosis. This can all affect the intestines, preventing them from absorbing vitamin D found in food. But there are also some risks of getting too much vitamin D. It is unlikely to happen through diet or sun exposure because your body regulates the amount of vitamin D produced through sun exposure. You should know vitamin D toxicity can result in a variety of health issues, such as frequent urination, apathy, vomiting, abdominal pain, dehydration, confusion, and increased thirst. And be careful. Caution is advised if you have diabetes, liver disease, or any other condition that requires you to limit or avoid these substances in your diet. Ask your doctor or pharmacist about using this product safely. We are changing things up, so you should wait for our videos, especially our playlist on different vitamins. You can support us to keep making great videos. Please like this video and subscribe to our channel so you won't miss them. Don't stay at home all day, because your body is praying for some sun. Have fun!